how to connect Source Tree to Azure DevOps. If you're struggling to connect your Source Tree to your Azure DevOps Git repository, you're not alone. Let's break down the steps to make this process smooth and efficient. First, you need to create a personal access token, PAT, in Azure DevOps. This token is essential for authentication. Go to your Azure DevOps account, navigate to the user settings, and generate a new PAT. Make sure to copy the generated token, as you won't be able to view it again after you leave the page. Next, open Source Tree and go to the Add an Account option. Here, you'll select Azure DevOps as the hosting service. For the host URL, use the format https slash yourorganizationname.visualstudio.com. It's important to note that the new URL format for Azure DevOps might not work, so stick with the older format. Now, enter the generated PAT as both the username and the password. This might seem unusual, but it's necessary for the authentication process. If SourceTree doesn't seem to be using the PAT credentials correctly, you can force it to do so by prefixing the repository URL with the PAT. For example, you would use HTTPS slash your PAT your organization name dot visual studio dot com slash your repo dot git. After setting up the account, you'll see a list of your repositories in the remote tab. Select the repository you want to clone and click the clone button. All the fields should be pre-filled so you can proceed with the cloning process. It's also worth mentioning that if you encounter any issues with the credentials being ignored, you can manually specify the credentials in the repository URL. This ensures that SourceTree uses the correct PAT for authentication. Once you've connected SourceTree to your Azure DevOps repository, you can start working on your projects seamlessly. You can create feature branches, commit changes, and push them to the remote repository using SourceTree's intuitive interface. By following these steps, you'll be able to leverage the best of both worlds, the ease of use of SourceTree and the robust features of Azure DevOps. This setup allows your team to work efficiently, whether they're using Mac or Windows, and it supports the Gitflow workflow, which is particularly useful for release-based projects. So there you have it, a straightforward guide to connecting SourceTree with Azure DevOps. Happy coding!